So I'm coming to you between Tesla T and Hogpen Gap. Hope I said that right. Um, as you can see behind me, the views are awesome. And this is a relatively easy place to get to if you're just trying to do a day hike from Hogpen Gap to this first overlook. But as you can see, it's quite beautiful. And I encourage you to take a short drive to Helen if you can't do a full Appalachian through hike to come out to Hogpen Gap. Make your way towards Tesla T Gap and you'll be able to see this awesome overlook. Down there is the Ravencliff uh, campsite. As you can see, this is where I spent the past 20 years camping. It's one of my favorite spots. So I'm on my way to Cow Rock Mountain, but from Hogpen going southbound, I should say, you know, past some really cool rocks along the way, cool places to stop off at. You can see it's pretty magnificent. See on the Appalachian Trail. And for those that don't know, you can always find your way back by following the white markers that are on the trees. So we are definitely still on the trail, but we are on our way to Cow Rock Mountain and just one of the spots that you'll see from Hogton Gap doing a small day hike out that way. So we are in the Ravencliff Wilderness, and as you can see, it's quite beautiful. That's pretty treacherous all the way up to Hogpen Gap. We're at Tesenti, and that's what we've got to go back up to to get to our destination at Hogpen. And down there is the start of the trek to Cow Rock Mountain. It's pretty cool out here. If you get a chance, you definitely should check out the AT, especially in the North Georgia. You gotta be a little fit though. Let's see, Tesla Gap. And Hogpen is about one mile from here. Straight up that way. As you can see, the uh, terrain is quite rugged. It's also awesome with all the rocks. It's quite beautiful out here. On our way to Cow Rock Mountain, it's going to be awesome. The bees on the flowers, more specifically, look at that overlook. As you can see it on his GoPro. We are up there. This is Metro coming to you live from Cow Rock Mountain. Uh, as you can see behind me, the views are awesome up here and there is hardly any traffic. Like popular places like Springer Mountain, Blood Mountain, you're gonna have a lot of people there. Uh, so as you're coming from Neal's Gap on the way up to Hogpen, this is what you're gonna see. It's a beautiful place to be. Highly recommend it and you should definitely come check it out.
So we were all the way over there. And we crossed that huge gap. May not look like a lot. That's a lot harder than you think it is. Go down there and then back out. Crazy. So hot pin gap, here it is, it's great. Hope you make it here. I've had a great day hiking. See you in a round. Peace.